Hi there, welcome to TMC. Today I'll be looking at this 2022 Volkswagen Caddy finished in grey. I'll be doing a little walk around the vehicle today showing you all the key features, details and cosmetics. And I'll be sure to point out anything over and above that of general wear and tear. First of all, we're starting out with the front end of the vehicle, starting with the bonnet. As I scan across, you'll see it's looking really nice and tidy. And we'll just move down to those front headlights, looking really nice and clear. No scratching or cracking in the lenses there at all. A few very light marks just down on the front bumper down here. And moving across that front grille, looking really nice and tidy across there. Same with the rest of that front bumper. Front headlight looking tidy. And we'll move around to that front passenger corner, front passenger arch, looking good. And that front uh, wheel trim there, just looking really nice and tidy. Got plenty of life left in those tires as well. Moving down the passenger side of the vehicle, we'll see that side mirror in good condition. And that front passenger door, got no significant uh, car park dings or scratches in there at all. And we'll just open up that door card, show you the inside. Got no significant damage there, nothing around the switches or handles. Full fabric uh, front seats in this vehicle, just two seats in the front. As you can see, no tearing around the edges or in the seat base at all. Looking nice and tidy there. And we'll just move around to the rear sliding door, passenger side. Looking tidy there. Show you the inside, showing you that bulkhead first of all. Got a few marks just along the bottom of that. Uh, it is one of the problem areas on these uh, types of vehicles. Stuff gets put up against uh, the sides or the rear doors, the bulkhead, all creates a few marks and uh, not uncommon to happen on these types of vehicles at all. Got a bit of a scratch just on the front of the arch there. Rest of that panel looking good. Rear lights there, looking tidy, no scratches or cracking at all. Reverse parking sensors, got a few uh, chips in the paint just down here and here, along here a little bit as well, but not too significant at all. And we'll just look at those rear doors now. We can see those looking really nice and tidy. You've got your reversing camera next to your caddy emblem. Driver's side, rear door, looking tidy as well. And I'll just open those up now, show you the uh, insides of those doors. Starting off with the inside of that driver's side rear door, looking tidy there, nothing really to point out. This is another one of the problem areas, but these uh, doors are looking really, really nice and tidy, largely uh, due to those uh, big wooden inlays that you're seeing there. And there's the uh, bulkhead for you there. We'll move around to the driver's side of the vehicle now, starting with that rear panel. Move around to that rear arch, looking tidy. And those rear wheel trims are just looking really nice and tidy. You've got plenty of tread left on those tyres as well. Now we'll just move further down the driver's side of that van. No big marks to point out at all there. Do have a bit of a small chip just on the, that door there. I'll just show you that door does open. driver's door that's looking good as well and that front arch and that front wheel trim does have a few marks just around the edges and in the spokes but otherwise looking very tidy and uh, there's alloys there or the uh, wheels sorry plenty of tread left on those take you to the inside of that driver's door now showing you that door card see that looking nice and tidy no significant damage around the switches or handles Got your electric seat controls just down here. That seat looking good. Got no tears around the seat base or the edges at all. I'll get inside the vehicle now, start the engine. I'll show you a few features. As you can see, we're on just over 40,000 miles on the clock. We do have a full Volkswagen uh, main dealer service history on this vehicle, which is always really nice to have. Manual gearbox, as you can see. 
you've also got your uh, electronic parking brake just there. If I put this in reverse, you'll see we have your reverse parking sensors and you've also got your reversing camera. Got your parking assist and climate control menus uh, just here. Here's your main menu on your infotainment system. You've got your Bluetooth telephone uh, connectivity. You've got your radio and media just here, which includes your FM and DAB stations. Got a few vehicle uh, setup information and settings just here. Got some user profile settings, sound equalizer, a few system settings just there as well. You do have your cruise control just on the steering wheel there. You've got your uh, light controls just here as well. These lights work by just tapping on them, they'll come straight on. As you can see, just there. This vehicle is available for viewing either through our online process or at our Hampshire based branch. If you have any further questions or inquiries on this vehicle, please do feel free to get in touch. And thank you very much for watching.